Oh, we are. We're good. Here it is. We interrupt this recording to bring you the Glitches Get Stitches podcast. Ladies and gentlemen, he thinks he's so cool with his dark sense of humor and sleek styled classic looks. Well, let me tell you all this. I saw him give a hobo a handjob outside of a rallies once, and he didn't even wash his hands before giving me the next handjob. I mean, wait, it's Jeff! Been four score and three months since I last wrote about the man. He's been grinding away on modern warfare, trying out Evil West, and spotlighting Midnight Suns. It feels like he's a whole new person since getting his new computer. It's Dakota. <laughs> if it isn't Deadpool rubbing off Spider-Man's hand, then it would be John's meme about a fuck toy in a box. This was the moment <laughs> that Facebook doxed us for a month. It doesn't matter because he's back and ready to take action as platform by storm. The three wise men ride into the new dawn. We follow you, John. Oh, let's fucking go. To the depths of hell together, brothers. Um, let me just see. I can, has can I pull this up on Facebook yet? What's going on? No notification at all. No, but I got the share. And I had a you got you did get the share. Yeah. I just had all right. Let yeah. me see something just real quick because I like to have it up. And the funky fried motherfucking chicken ass motherfucking mm, shit. Chicken yeah, Jeff with a natural twenty, yeah, right? Not on my stream, though. Just all yeah. right. There's this. Hold on. Let me turn down this so I don't have this interference. I tag you so it uh maybe it'll help. Maybe it will help. Yeah, I didn't, there we go. I didn't get a notification or anything. Yeah. I, I just Did anyone share. get a notification in the chat right now? What up, everybody? How we doing? I think Dakota got something to share, or he just shared it. That's where I, that's where I got it. Yeah, I shared and I tagged John from uh that so we can. With you know, it's just Facebook. All right, I'm almost done. Hold on, I got it. I got pulled up. I got to pull it up. I got to pull it up. Okay, pull I'm it up like and pull out. Yes, time. You know what I'm saying? All right, what up, everybody? Welcome, universe, to a brand new episode 107 of the 2GS show, Glitches Get Stitches podcast. It's been a minuto, guys. It's been a minuto. It's all Jeff's fault. Um, find us on Instagram, Twitter, Hover. TikTok, Discord, and our sad and lonely home Facebook now, where we are shunned upon and everyone hates us. <laughs> God. Um, and all right, now we're also live on Twitch. So if you are like it at Twitch, you go over there, say hello. Um, <laughs> if you haven't already, please hit the like, hit the share, drop a comment, say what's up, Ray Ray. I see you in the chat. Anybody else in the chat, I'll say what's up if I see you. Uh, if you miss a live podcast and want to catch up on any episodes you missed for free, visit 4-Eyed Radio Network, iTunes, Apple Podcasts, Spotify, YouTube. That's actually great if you go over there and hit the subscribe button while you're over there. That's that's uh, we, we need you to do that, please. We're building an army over there. Jacob, what up? We have brought shame to the family, Jacob. You know what else is shameful? Mm. This drink that I'm holding right now. God. Where's the alcohol in it, Jeff? There isn't. It's an issue. Then why even drink it? Exactly. God damn it. I'm fasting too for 30 days. 
<laughs> I'm just kidding. You know I got to eat, Arby. Um, today's brand new episode 107 is brought to you by Diarrhea. Someone in this podcast will have it soon. We'll find out why John John was a bad boy and how he effed up the GGS Facebook page. We sacrificed Dakota to the Facebook gods for our page to be remonetized. Wait, what? <laughs> is also is remonetized a word? Demonetized. It is now. now. Remonetized. I made that up. And uh, Jeff gives us an hour and a half of his attention, kinda. So grab a hold tight. <laughs> oh, he and we lost. <laughs> And let's go, everybody, baby. Oh. All right, so we got some GGS news we can talk about. Um, John posts a meme, gets banned for 30 days, and gets GGS page demonetized. Dakota posts a meme, gets 5 million hits on the page, and he's an all-star. Mm-hmm. It's, 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 this, is, this is a normal thing for GGS. Yeah, so... so I don't I know ideas. what mine was, okay? But f- damn it. It's not fair. But so here's what happened. I posted a, a meme that was a little naughty to our page, to our people, okay? It was fine. It had been there for a couple weeks. It was sitting there just in the dungeon of our filth as GGS. You know, we had, we've had the same kind of community over the last four and a half years. So you know what you're getting into. If you're GGS, you're getting into filthy stuff. Okay. So I had this filth on the page. It was doing fine. It was doing fine with our, with our 4,000 followers. And then Dakota had to come in and post his Deadpool jerking off Spider-Man's Spidey vein. On December first, by the way, five million hits to the page. Five million was the reach, the total reach. After all was said and done, we hit over five million. So one of those brand new five million people that didn't know what GGS was saw the picture, the meme, and reported old John John. So right now, it was me. So I got banned. Right, got banned for thirty days. Come back. I would think everything's going to be fine. It's not fine. And I want this all to come back. And it's Dakota's fault. Because if he wouldn't have got us famous, we would have been all right. (laughs) We also would have made a lot of money if if we didn't post uh, something that had nothing to do with video games. But it's okay. We we made $266 before we got cut off off of that meme for the page. We probably would have made seven million dollars. So way to go! We had the Dakota. bonus. At least. <laughs> Y'all could have had new computers. All of our followers could have had new computers, but now. So <laughs> you get a new computer. You get a new computer. So here's where we're at now. If you press the star button right now, you can't send a star. It says we're not in part of level one. Um, there's no support to talk to if you're part of Facebook Gaming. You already know this. If you watch streams, you probably heard your fellow streamer bitch about it at some point. Um, we're, I've seen people, I've been hunting like a crazed person in the nights, uh, also dressed like Batman, uh, <laughs> while I'm just reading Twitter stuff, I'm the greatest detective. <laughs> That's what I tell you myself. You mean DFV, <laughs> diabetes fat bat. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And we're waiting to either find some, some support because right now we're not able to put in a request. It says review request or request a review on the situation. We messed up. I did my time. Please reinstate us. I'll never do it again. I swear to God, okay? That's what uh, I would say to them if the, if they let me review uh, request a review or whatever. Fuck it, it. But it, it won't let us. It's grayed out. The button is not there for us. So there's nobody to talk to, no support. Right now, we can only get supporters. So with that said, thank you for supporting Glitches Get Stitches at this time. Um... You guys are literally our lifelines until we get this sorted out. We're going to play the game on this page and, um, you know, see if something clicks in a place because that's how Facebook gaming works. It either doesn't work and then it or it clicks in a place. It does work. So we're going to give it some time, let it marinate, see what happens. If we have to start a new page on Facebook, we will talk about it with you guys and go down that road if we need to. But right now we're just chilling here. Um, yeah, we, those are rookie numbers, Mark. We got to get those. The five million. 
I couldn't believe it though, Dakota. It was five million or one point five million. Five million. Yeah. Was the total reach? One point five was probably f- like how many like interactions or something mm. it got or whatever. But the total That's... reach of people that saw our page was over five million. Oh, I we got remember. two followers. So all we got to do is start a new page and post that meme to that page, right? <laughs> uh, but we will do that if we have to. <laughs> anyway, so we're there. You guys are here. We love you. Thanks for everything. Thanks for hanging out with us. Um, and we'll keep you guys in a loop. Here's another thing. And GGS. Another um, we had uh, we did our charity for AM Vets in November. We sent four hundred and fifty dollars to AM Vets. C- congratulations, to everybody! G G S G G S. Um, Mole Man won recently won the giveaway for that top prize, which was some Overwatch memorabilia and the Astro A twenty headset. He has now donated them back to the channel, so I'm I'm going to throw the Astro A twenties up for grabs. For supporters, because you guys are the, our only lifeline right now. You're very special to us. You've always been special to us. Now you're fucking really special to us. Um, so we're, we're gonna we're gonna throw that your way. We'll I'll do the giveaway later on this month for the Astro Eight Twenties, and then we'll figure out what to do with the Overwatch memorabilia. We we're gonna give that away too. We're gonna figure out to who later on, and we'll let you guys know. Anyway, thank you, Mole Man. You my boy, Mole Man. Uh, let's sad cheers. To episode 107. It's good to see you, boys. Drink, Jeff, will you drink for me? Drink it slower. <laughs> Slam this whole thing. <laughs> oh, I'm not drinking either, so. Are you doing, like, the whole whole month? Like, dry? No, I'm, doing, just... no, I'm doing a whole day. Oh! Mother... Once a week. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah, I forgot. It's podcast day. His yep. no drink day. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Got to keep up with the times. Fucking silly Sally. Ray, Ray, the goblins here, spreading all the goblins cheer. Son of a bitch right now. Sober as a Sally. <laughs> Sounds terrible. So long. Is this alcohol? Um, no, keep trying. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, another twenty minutes of this. It's perfect time. Sorry, to this hit is it. and cops with you like this. I remember my first time. Oh god, Dakota. Hey, how have you been? Good. Um. All right, you've been playing some games. Mm-hmm. So when you're you've here. been mentally preparing for Harry Potter, the thrill ride. Is that, I think that's a new game. Is that what it's called? Yeah, Harry Potter and the Sorcerer Got Stoned. There it is. Right? Yeah. yeah, something like that. I know you've been waiting for that one. So in mm-hmm. the meantime, you've been doing some Modern Warfare. Mm-hmm. Warzone. You actually, <laughs> I saw you get some dubs. I've never, I didn't think that was possible. I thought it was only Fairy Terror Tales and Stone Mountain got dubs. Oh, I didn't even think I got a dub on, sc- on stream. <laughs> I guess I, maybe I guess I have. I only had three dubs. One for yeah, sure was got off. Two of them the first fucking day you played it, you son of a bitch. Mm. That was I done forever. It was so, it, it was so long ago. <laughs> God, your memory is like a wilted. Thing. Actually, I actually have a phenomenal memory, but I think we're thinking of two different times these happen. But it's okay. I remember I got well, I know I got one on stream. But... The yeah. first day you played, you went live with not me, three other people. Yeah, right? and I died and they won, so we gotta win. Yeah, but I didn't do anything. <laughs> you were in the thing, and then I th- and then you won another one, I thought. Uh not the same day. Definitely not the same day. Uh, you were part of the group project. Yeah, yeah, exactly. God damn it. I'm that one kid that like is like, hey, uh, I Mr. Hear. Baby Lungs, Jacob. You show up on the last day. <laughs> Wait, this is still due, right? Yeah. All right, tell us about what you've been playing there. Uh, I mean, Warzone. I've been playing uh, Evil, West, Evil on and off. West. God, yeah, God of War on and off. Yeah. Um, 
And Midnight Suns, I, I was playing it a bunch when it first came out, but I, I put that one down just trying to catch up on you other shit too. You don't have Wolverine. You nope. don't have Wolverine. I have a game that works. It's called Evil West, though. I'm further than you did. All right, got yeah, it. Yeah, <laughs> I already deleted it. I had it deleted. It was messing yeah. up my PS5. What, I'm going to let it run? Yeah. I feel like no, the you're the only person I know that gets their PS like messed up from games. Yeah, I haven't, never had an issue. I haven't had an issue yet. I'm not making it up. It literally happened live on fucking stream. I got. I, it's not like I that's, want it to. Think, think I want it to? I think it's part of your your Elgato. You just have a you have a button freezes. I will break everything in this fucking room right now. That's Jeff, another just button on the Elgato stream deck. A point. <laughs> God Stop damn. Implode. All right. How you like an Evil West? It's good. I, I'm having fun with that. At first, I, it was kind of boring because, like, going with what you said, playing. I was playing God of War, and then I went over. I was like, this is like like too easy and like just too fucking like i'm playing a playstation one version of of god of war hey, god of that, war light bro the you nailed it with the ps1 little analogy right there I, I couldn't explain it but i was like just it's a good game <laughs> just yeah i just got finished playing god of war ragnarok though and went i mean literally beat it started it up that i'm like uh-huh. yeah it's like god of war extra light yeah it god is of war, no mayo game, yeah, it's a lot of fun. The story's really cool, actually. I'm I'm really digging the story. The story's cool. Vampires, cowboys. Yeah. Assless chaps, Jeff. Your favorite. Download it mm-hmm. right now. <laughs> Download it. That's actually Are the main you, character's uh, name. I, I remember you did have a slight interest in Evil West. Is that gone now? No, it's still. I'll still. I'll still get to it. It's just a, a bunch of shit happened at the same time because it's the same studio that made Shadow Warrior. So I already mm-hmm. heard it's probably. Gonna be, <laughs> not, oh, not, is it? I'm nice. gonna like it. Yeah. Wait. Um. Hey, and also Dakota, tell all your Valorant fans. Valorant. Why oh. you can't play Valorant? Um, I'm never playing Valorant again. Ooh. Dan, Dan. I'm just kidding. It'll happen at some point. I just, I, it's something in my BIOS, and I can't figure it out. And I've looked up videos and shit, and none of them match the same motherboard I have to go into BIOS, and because they all look different. Everybody's BIOS. I was thinking about just maybe downgrading my PC to Windows 10. I just haven't got the courage yet because I like how Windows 11 looks. My computer was like, upgrade to Windows. Oh, uh, Jacob with the eight-month subscriber. Let's go. He's got three Twinkies on a sub badge now. Cheers, Dude, cheers uh, to that. Cheers to that. Alcohol. Sober, John. I'm getting so drunk, guys. Oh, man. <laughs> I'm not so sober. I'm getting more sober by the drink. That's because you're <laughs> drinking an energy drink. <laughs> you got to do it like the old LA Beast did. Smoke your alcohol. Yeah. Oh, yeah. God. That was, that was an old video. But he did a, a They have bars video. like that in LA now that do that shit. I think it's very, very bad for you. <laughs> I wouldn't want to do it. I would just, just I'll drink. give you a week. I'm like, Jeff, I moved on to this really cool thing. It's like a crack pipe. <laughs> but I'm like, John, it looks a little weird at first. John will butt chug, but he won't smoke his alcohol. <laughs> There's no calories in the butt chug, John. I know. All right. Well, we hope you get Pure Valorant damage. back. Yeah. Uh, they go straight. Need to, yeah, it goes straight to where it needs to go. When and when it's going to come out later. My ass. Same spot you put it in. Yep. I uh, hope you get Valorant back soon and your BIOS computer stuff, is which I'm never ever getting a PC because then if I just want to play a game, I can just play a game and I don't have to worry about going into a BIOS. Nope, don't get that. Windows 11. That's yeah, all. Just a little, yeah, just Windows 11. I met, yeah, I messaged Jeff. I was like, do I get Windows 11? He's like, no. <laughs> that was a hard no. No. Follow Ray. 399 days. Let's go. Ray Ray got four. What did Ray, did I miss Ray Ray's uh sub thing? I don't know why they make this little screen. Ray's thirteen, like 13, 13 months. Thirteen months. Let's fucking go, dude. Yeah. We love you guys that much. Um, Jeff. John. My name a Jeff. His name a Jeff. Cause I got platinum. What Are you proud of me that, that I got two platinums this year? I don't see another one ever happening again <sighs> until the next God of War. Dare you? <laughs> you mean? You didn't even All clap right. the first God of War. 
I didn't know it was like that, Jeff. You would have. Okay. You did it. I played it and I beat it. And as soon as the credit roll, I delete it. And that rhymed and put that down in something till the end of except, time. Except you did wow. because you played after the credit. Stretch there, but you got it. <laughs> All right, Jeff, you've been playing some games here because you uh, have quit Overwatch 2. You know, it's like someone quit smoking. <laughs> you you, got, you quit back. Overwatch 2, cold turkey. I'll How are you feeling? I'll, I'll come back when they introduce the, the social <laughs> smoking Overwatch. PBE. You got PBE? <laughs> that PBE? That's great. Let me see them talent trees. <laughs> I love... All right. Uh... You've been playing some games. You beat. Is it Callisto? Callisto. All right, all right. So you're big. You're the you're big dead space fan, obviously. Um, you've streamed them before, I believe, back in the day, day. Yeah. How did this hold up as a, as a, a, a one of those types of games? Uh, it held up pretty well. Super short, obviously, as you saw. I think I did it in like three streams or mm -hmm. something, but they made it, it set itself apart from Dead Space uh, enough to where the similarities were just horror, scary, and graphics. You're, so, you're good at those games, too. This one was different because it was a lot of melee dodging and melee heavy until you, later on when it's all Because <laughs> I... I was always ahead of you. I think I I beat it before you, and then I I, I would you would be getting to a part, and I'd be like, "Oh man, Jeff's gonna die so many times at this part," and he didn't, and he would not die, and I'd not be until like, "Later." <laughs> I mean, it would take it would take me fifty times at this part, especially. You remember that one part when you're like, "Oh, there's a lot of bombs on the ground here." Oh it's yeah. Like, and I'm like. I used every one of those bombs to survive this part. Jeff didn't use one of the fucking bombs at all. Bobbing and weaving. Bobbing and weaving, understanding the parry and dodging and slapping and plapping. It's just crazy how, like, you different you can play games. I'm like a fucking caveman. That, oh. That's, I want to see Jeff try like a Souls game. Just I want to like, because I think he I think he could do pretty good. No, I, I don't do good at them. I have, like, Man, two of dude, them. I, I have Dakota. I have thought of so many ways to try to bribe Jeff into playing Elden Ring, and I just can't. I can't. There's, I can't come up with a value that would make him be like, "All right, I'll do it." Because well, if, I think the same thing. I think he'll love it too. I think. What if? What if we play Elden Ring on co-op on PC? Because they have a co-op now mod People for for it. PC. Uh, That'd be fucking fun. I think that would be actually a lot of fun. Like. Three or four people on their horses just running around bosses and shit. That'd be fucking super fun. Oh, like super. The, it's like unofficial, right? It's not. Yeah, like it's, it's a side mod that somebody created and you can yeah. access it. But like, I'm, I'm, imagine four mages, John. Like four mages all oh, just on their dude. horses, just spamming meteors at dragons and shit. It would be a. It would. It would be a whole different kind of game. Yeah. It, would, it wouldn't be. A, I'm on the brink of suicide. No, I think it'd actually be a lot of fun. Like, <laughs> Jeff's like, wait a second. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> downloading now. I'm sad. <laughs> All right, Jeff. You also played a uh, oh, and Dakota did too. I forgot. High on life. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, that was fun. Jeff streamed the whole thing, and then Dakota streamed a couple streams of it too. But um, just, just one. You uh, Dakota, what'd you think of it? Oh, I liked it a lot. It was a lot of fun. I want to get back into it. Uh, but it was. I had a blast playing it. The quirkiness, all the fucking jokes and shit. Even when you pause it, the fucking guns make fun of you. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Jeff, you beat it. What'd you think about it? You're, you're, you guys are both Rick and Morty fans. Mm -hmm. Yeah. No, I would. Re I really liked it. I can. I can. Just that. Uh, that lengthy style of humor that just goes on and on and over explaining yeah. himself and doing. I don't know. I just it. it, it I call it the. Uh, the, the going. I call it the Family Guy humor, where they just literally drag out something oh, think, as far as they can go like just a staring scene for over a minute you know what i mean or something just like that just oh like, yeah except but this it, this the straight dialogue and just random first thing that comes to your head 
leading into oh, the next, yeah, yeah. leading into the next sentence over and over and over. Oh, oh, like, oh, okay. I got you. Very okay. That's that's that is Rick and Morty style right there. Yeah, yeah, I, I, okay. I've, I've been seeing another clip go around where like there was like a, a speed running thing. You can try and avoid some enemies at some point. And yeah. once, once you get past him, you drop down, and the little guy pops up. He's like, "Oh, hey, look! Looks like you're trying to speed run this. Hey, eh? you know, trying to cheat doing that." It's like that's it. That's a okay in our book. You know, we're cool with that. If you want to, that's how you. That's your. That's it's your game. You know, we're this is we're just playing it, and it's, <laughs> but it just goes on and on and on. <laughs> that's fucking awesome. But nothing happens. Like it, it doesn't. Maybe they don't like kick you or anything. No, they just it's just a, an extra piece of dialogue that comes in. That's dope. Very dope. Very dope. Um, you stream modern warfare 2 last time because uh, so what's next for you that's what i'm getting at what's your next like game are you waiting for dead space gonna be modern warfare until then or you know unless i can pull something out of my ass that might just be oh modern warfare. i can help you with that something other than diarrhea oh i, can't. Uh, I, don't, I don't think you can help you with that <laughs> uh it uh, have to be something i can beat in a couple weeks because dead space is like the middle of mid 25th or some shit 24th i think or it's, it's either the 27th yeah 27th. it's like two days after forespoken mm. and i thought they just would both come out on a friday because you so it must be like early access i don't fucking know anyway 24th yeah, 20, is, yeah 27th is dead space 27th. remake there you go i can't wait to watch you play are you uh are you gonna be playing uh hogwarts at all jeff I are you interested have, in that i don't have any plans in it Hmm. I'm the I'm the sacrilege that has actually never seen a Harry Potter movie. Oh wow, that's impressive, actually. <laughs> I don't now. It's just now. I feel like I can't. Just, just <laughs> Jacob a, said Skyrim. You should get into Skyrim. Yeah, I could be Skyrim uh, in, two weeks. Weeks. <laughs> in two weeks. <laughs> I can't because I fucking go everywhere yeah, in that game. I couldn't do it. It would take I have beat seventy it. years to stream the whole At game. Least. <laughs> At least, seven years. at least. I mean, I have probably I have like six hundred hours in that game. I think that's the game I have the most besides like uh, Rocket League because I had Rocket League just running in the background and so my PC would yeah. shut off. So I have like three billion hours on that game. But uh, yeah, I I fucking love Skyrim. I'll always go back to the game. All up. right, all right. Let's get to let's get to me. Okay, John, John. I'm doing great. Thanks, We're everyone. For, oh, yeah. sorry. Yeah. Been a while. Hey everyone in, uh, in the chat coming in. I think I saw Lydia with a like or something like that. Thanks, Mikey. Maybe it's okay. You've never seen Star Wars. See those? That's those are both impressive to anyone that's never seen like a huge mainstream thing. That's that's nuts. Those I never seen Girls Gone Wild. Liar. Liar. <laughs> You've seen the commercials at least. <laughs> oh, many times. <laughs> oh yeah. All right, all right. All right. I'm doing great. Uh, how's Facebook jail? You ask. It was long and cruel. Okay, I I got. Did you start going out I'm, in the backyard and, and smoking and breaking your ribs like Ron? <laughs> I lift some weights. <laughs> and no, then I'd smoke a cigarette. You turned into Ron. He doesn't lift weights. <laughs> <laughs> oh God, it was a lot. I mean, it was nice for a little mental break, though. You know, because I've been going hard on this for a while. But like, I, I I'm ready to get back. And now the page is all. So I'm like, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. anyway, good to be back. Overwatch 2 got platinum 4, so I'm very happy about that. Speaking of platinum, I platinumed. So Jeff got me Sonic Frontiers for Christmas. Thanks, Jeff. Uh, do you have what I ha what did I get you for Christmas? Show it, show it, because we couldn't stream, so no one can see it. Can you reach it? Yeah, you oh, could yeah. stream. Huh? He could stream. You could stream. Yeah, we stream. Uh, you know what I'm <laughs> he could have streamed on Facebook, or I mean Twitch. Uh, he could Twitch or YouTube, you know, but it's okay. Yeah, it's okay. Look at that. This what I got. Look oh. at that. Ragnarok. Controller. Yeah. Are you ever going to open it or just keep it in the box? I don't know. I want to just... <laughs> Like maybe if, if maybe it. for God of War 3, you crack that thing open. Oh, crack that, that ass. No, open. Well, then it's me vintage. Yeah. That's true. That's true. Uh, anyway, let me, let me just mention real quick the Sonic game. Dakota streamed it. And then I saw it and I was like, it looks All right, there's some cool things about it. I still wasn't like 100% about it. 
David, and, and usually when I've, I've bought a couple games because you're streaming Dakota, like Midnight Suns, stuff like that. So I, I take your streaming very seriously when I watch you. I'm like, I'm like, I'm this game. Um, I still wasn't sold on it. And then Jeff got it for me. I played it and it is fucking awesome. Uh, if you like Sonic and it, it gave me old school Dreamcast Sonic adventure vibes. Does it have that same soundtrack? If they had the original Sonic Adventure soundtrack, I would buy it right now. Uh, I I will lie to you. I will lie to your face just for you to ho- hopefully try it. Because I now think I know like, you're lying. Yeah, no, no, you're lying. No, yeah. I mean yes, it's there. It's totally there, John uh, Jeff. It's it's there. I played the it. The soundtrack right? is fucking bumping though. When you turn into Super Sonic, they got five yeah. different custom songs that they wrote. It is pretty dope. Uh, they you, go fucking hard. You could just plug up, plug in the Dreamcast and play the original Sonic Adventure. I know, because I bought an adapter too, so I can go straight a what is it AV to you could HDMI. stream it. Yeah, you could totally oh, stream it. Fun. All right, and then uh, yeah, <clears throat> dude, it's so much fun. But let's get into it. Trains with benefits. Spirits, spirits, spirits. Hey, Mikey, how you doing? You about to go to work? Donna, you didn't answer. Uh, you didn't. I have a question for you before we skip off on what you're playing. How's Witcher? Me? Yeah. It's good. I got. Um, it, uh, let me tell you some. The HD versions of Yennefer's movies. The menu looks really cool. Uh, no, I actually got to. <laughs> Jeff, you remember what we played? I like, yeah. I like the tree and the campfire. Um, I got to. Did you start over? That did king? you? Huh? Did you start over or did you just... I started all the way over because oh. I wanted to see Jennifer's boobies in the beginning and HD. That's, that's what it does. Yep. Um, so I got to the king that's telling me now the next quest is to go find his daughter. That's the baby thing that... So the, bar- the Baron. Yep. Yeah, the Baron. That part. The so, baron. I mean... I mean, obviously, it's going to be a long time for me to get anywhere in this game. So... Well, you, yeah, say that. you just got to download the glider, you know? Yeah. yeah. All yeah, right, turn the benefits. That's dreams. where, huh? Ben. <laughs> that's where we GGS keep you up to date with everything that's going on out there. Video games, pop culture, relevant material. Let's go. Square Enix new game for Spoken comes out at the end of the month on twenty. What do we say? Twenty fourth. The twenty fourth. Yes. Yeah. The demo is out now. Did either of you guys play the demo? I did not. I did. And I just want to say I'm a little nervous <laughs> on mm. the overall what is going on <laughs> aspect of it. You know what I'm saying? Like the story I, or just I I don't you know what? I don't I don't even know. It's Square Enix, so part of me is very excited because they make Final Fantasy Sevens. <laughs> then, that's not when they made just the final fantasy 7 and the remake you know what i mean final seven. fantasy stuff all the seven Final fantasy stuff so i'm excited about it but they also made avengers so it's you know that's a fucking avengers was great <laughs> so i'm nervous about it i played it it feels like it, so she goes fast you know she's a she goes fast like sonic yes it's like Square Enix was like, all right, they're coming out with a Sonic game. We need we go something that goes fast. We gotta go fast. Yeah, really, it does. It seemed like they copied. I don't know. I don't want to say copied. I, I got to play more of it, but it's, it's a little weird. Anyway, let's talk about this big news. The Last of Us. HBO Max comes out Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. You better be there. You better be dead. Oh God! I don't want to be there. Oh, I can do. I can do that. Is that too far? I mean, <laughs> you don't have you don't have a, a bounce house yet. It's not Sunny's or Scout's birthday. Get away. That's this. That's next that's month. Next month, though. So. Yeah. <laughs> um. So I read that they gave the show more money than they gave Game of Thrones. Good. Do you know what that means? It's gonna be better than Game of Thrones. That's what it means to me. Because you know what? Money buys greatness in every aspect, really. If you think about it, 
But um, I like, what we're talking about? I feel like Rings, Can I have of, a Rings of Power got more than the uh, Avengers. I like but, Rings. Uh, I, I mean, uh, in HBO. Oh, okay. In HBO Avenue. Okay. More money equals more greatness. And the House of Dragon or or uh, Game, of Game of Thrones. Okay. Game of Thrones. Uh, I'm excited. You guys excited for this? I am. Yeah. I love Pedro oh. Pascal. Uh huh. And I'm gonna yeah. I'm gonna piggyback off this because I feel like you're gonna skip it. Cause, but uh, uh Legend of Vox Machina also is coming out this month with season two. So you should have told me to put it on here. Well, yep. I feel like it was just announced like last month or something. <clears throat> I know they uh they were signed right with the Kickstarter. Right when Amazon picked him up, they were already signed for a second season. Oh, so like, they, like instantly. They just went through it. Mm-hmm. Jeff, did you watch that show? Not yet. I Dude, not it's yet. fucking good. Yeah, it looks good. I need to do You that. know, I'm not the biggest D&D guy, but I mean, it doesn't matter. Need to be to me, I'm watching an RPG. Yeah. It has nothing to do with D&D, you know? Like, not, I mean, it does, but it's like it's about the, the player's story, but like as far as like, you don't see dice rolls and things like that. No, I'm just saying. It's if, fantasy. If someone says the show they explain it like it's D D type show to so somebody who doesn't isn't in a D D that might scare them to not watch it you know well, what I'm saying? i mean that could be house of dragon that could be fucking uh Ring of power no that's all that's they, they all didn't fantasy had D when the dragons was made dude it's, it's all fantasy god damn it john there wasn't even <laughs> dice made when there was dragons homie. there's no dice in the show god damn it next segment <laughs> sorry i brought it up god shit you know what really gets uh, Dakota's grinds years going D and D. Dicks and dudes. Uh, hey, <laughs> hey, hey, all of us. Um, machine, 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 machine. Oh, okay. So, Elden Ring. We were talking about that. We're gonna talk about it in a minute. In a minute. Um, there is a streamer, Miss Mika, who has now defeated two millennia simultaneously. Whilst using a dance pad. And I just have one thing to say. Get a life, nerd! <laughs> just kidding. That's awesome because you know how I defeated Millennia? Right. By herself? With someone I else summoned for two high-powered yeah. people. Huh? Yeah, with someone else killing her for you. <laughs> yes. I summoned two high-powered people to fight her while I ran and hid in the corner like a man. That's how I defeated it. I think I think Jeff could beat uh, Elder Ring on a DDR pad. I mean, weren't you like weren't you like super big in a D- yeah. uh, DDR? I mean, <laughs> I, yeah, that's, that's that's it. That's that's the way. That's it. If we ever have a GGS like stomping ground where we have like a building or some kind of formal business, there will be a D a dance dance thing for Jeff, and yeah. that will be his office yeah i think we'll go <laughs> dancing his happy ass all day long do it in his grandma's voice style <laughs> yeah yeah new high school what does that mean what's that mean what does that mean that's weird <laughs> did i break it it's actually you gray bush <laughs> <laughs> all right moving on there is a blade game being developed at ubisoft blade game blade ubisoft ubisoft blade what do we think? Is it Ubisoft who uh, who's not made it, but like that's part of uh, Midnight Suns? Isn't that part of their? Uh, I don't think so. Their browser? No, maybe not. I don't think so. I don't even know who made Midnight Suns. I don't think it's Square Enix. No, I, no, I think it was no. Uh, Dakota will find out in a second. Yeah, because listen I up. I'm gonna say it was Insomniac Blade. for some reason. Blade is in Marvel Midnight Madness. Whatever. Midnight. <laughs> It's made by Frax, uh, Fire Axis. Fire? Yeah, I don't even know who that is. Uh, yeah, I don't know who that is. Uh, I'm excited for it because I want more Blade. I want more Blade now, Jeff. Yeah, we saw why you want more Blade. Yeah, we know, John. Yeah, posted it's... it everywhere. And it's Mantis. <laughs> <Why do> you... <laughs> Raptor Jesus. Hey, yeah. Did you see that? He came to battle. That dude, that was the funniest glitch I ever seen, dude. Oh yeah, XCOM. Uh, yeah, they did X-com, the whole XCOM the series. X-coms, that's what I was Civilization. Saying. All those like uh, t- uh, do turn-based games. Raptor Jesus said, "Scared of uh, Blade and their little French Canadian ham." <laughs> <laughs> How's the boot? We fight now. E? Uh, <laughs> oh, 
I'll get you there, yeah. vampire. Eh? Hey, don't you know? So in in Midnight Suns, you can go to. There's a little like area where where there's a pool. So you have <laughs> yeah. you have a you can get swimsuit attire. You know, there's some for uh, Miss Marvel that I've looked at very thoroughly. Uh, there's some for the other chick. I forgot her fucking name, but I remember. Magic? Those two. Magic? <laughs> yeah, magic's the best one. Yeah, 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 and Wolverine. So anyway, you can choose to put the swimming trunks on when you go and visit the pool. It's the only time that it shows the character in a thing. So anyway, when you go to load into a fight, you show up on whatever costume you put on your characters. You know, every character uh, you can custom. So anyway, this motherfucker came out in his underwear. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like suited up. That's nice tradition. And... <laughs> you have like a whole like wetsuit on where he's just got like underwear on. He's like, dude, we're not even oh, going to the ocean. Yeah. We're going to our backyard. And, you... <laughs> and that's on every single social media site we have. Go watch it. Don't Sorry. forget our TikTok. Mm-hmm. TikTok. Oh man, it was good. Um. All right. God, all right, okay, so here, back to the HBO with the money and the stuff and the Amazon with the Lord of the Rings. Here's what scares me, Jeff mm. and Dakota. Commitment. God of War is being made at Amazon. I don't know anything about it yet, though, so. I'm not going to even say a thing, except for I wish it was at HBO Max, but. Amazon's I'm got money, too, though. Huh? Amazon's got money too, though. I mean, Amazon's got more money. I like yeah. this. I liked the Lord of the Rings, the new one. Was it the best? No. Did you, I guys just, you like it? the production value probably more on HBO side than than Amazon? I mean, that's what it, I mean. I imagine we seem like you. I just just want it to be good. Please, God. Oh. Yep. Yep. Mm-hmm. We all do. All right, Elden Ring won Game of the Year. I'm sad that not we Jeff didn't size, do, huh? Not in Jeff size. No, I know, I know. I'm gonna I'm say, I'm gonna say a little song. song. A prayer. A prayer for you. Hey Jeff, can you say that? What did your shirt say? What did your shirt say there? Yeah. yeah. There you go. Yeah. There you go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, Elden Ring won Game of the Year. I'm also sad that we didn't get to do GGS's Game Awards this year because Dakota. Messed it up for everyone, but <laughs> mm-hmm. yep. <laughs> I'm We'd be rolling in cash right now, but it's cool. I'm sorry. All right, so yeah, okay, they won. Uh, okay, when Elden Ring first came out, I was I all about it. I had mentioned it plenty of times since then. Probably gonna be tough to beat Elden Ring in for Game of the War, unless God of War really pulls it out of their ass. Elden Ring's probably going to take it. I said it many times. Jeff always stood strong. He said, no! God of War! Man! We'll win! I thought Gotham Knights was going to win, for real. I mean, I'm really pulling for that one. Gotham Knights. I got to stare at Batgirl's ass for 45 hours while I slapped people around, so I ain't that mad. I ain't that mad. (laughs) And then, uh, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. Okay, but then I started playing God of War. And I instantly thought, I instantly, I was, I, I was like I knew in all my mind that God of War was going to win now. Because I thought in-your-face storytelling and an overall better combat system would win. Because, but no, it's not. The people don't want that, Jeff. What do they want? Hard for hardness sake. <laughs> and sp- scattered lore. I still don't know the story. I've heard nobody talk about the story other than there, one awards. No one knows. No one if someone can tell you the story to Elden Ring, I'll fucking S my own D right yeah, here. Live. All right, so I'm no gonna one. go ahead and YouTube the, the story lore <laughs> right now with uh just John in the background. I'll pop him out. <laughs> <laughs> And I just came. Um, listen. Here's the here's the here's the combat system in Elden Ring. I have a heavy strike, I have a light strike, I have two moves that I'm attached, and then I can heal myself or drink a little potion. 
but I want to change that. I have to go. That's it. That's it. A lot of rolling going around. Okay. A lot of rolling going around. Not saying that the combat wasn't fun. Obviously I've spent 150 fucking hours playing this game. It was just, it was simple. You had your moves that you had set and you had your heavy strike. You go up, you, you know, you did your thing, you killed thing, rolled a lot and, and hit it. Then had someone, someone to beat it for you because exactly. you can't do it yourself. Exactly. God of war at, if you learn the move, you have it at your fingertip. So when you're maxed out, you have three different weapons that you can pull up at any given time. You can use two super moves on those three weapons at any given time. You can control your second party character, Freya or Loki shooting arrows, turning into fucking or shooting things and stuff like that. You can then do your fucking combos that you've learned that are sometimes just crazy. The combos you can, I mean, the combat to me is, it's crazy above Elden Ring, but people don't want that Jeff. Okay. People don't want that Dakota. They want to roll, 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 strike. Okay. I'm learning for myself. Anyway, it didn't win. Congratulations, Elden Ring. I did love you. I do love you. You're a good game. I was just sad that I Ragnarok. Anyway, Jeff, God of War Ragnarok. Mm-hmm. We're not getting into any like thing things, but I just wanted to know because you're our chief analysis. Analysis? Analyst? Analyst. Analyst. Yeah. Analyst. On the subject. These are main analysts. Yeah, exactly right. Four different weapons. Um, so like, because you had your you, you could do you hold your square down or whatever and it does something. All right, wait, no. Yeah, I know what you mean. It's like a uh uh what is it? You could attach a weapon to your L1 and circle relic. Did you ever get that weapon? All the swords? Unless he's talking about shield or unarmed, which would be or five shield. or five yeah, weapons. Yeah, yeah. But, I think uh, but uh, anyway, a lot. Pro- po- point proven, I think. Anyway, so, Jeff, what did you think about God of War Ragnarok? Uh, it was amazing, obviously. A little I, Do you think it, harder than the go. first. Yeah? I was surprised. Did it set out to do what it was what it was trying to do? Did it was it bigger and better than the first one? Uh, it was it was bigger and better. It, the story didn't end quite like I thought it was going to. Yes, this so is true. there was. Um, <clears throat> I don't know. I was a, I was just confused at the end of the story, is all because they said, "Yep." We're summing up the entire thing in these two games. The Norse mythology's done. We don't have anything planned further. So that's mm-hmm. why I'm like, the perfect time for Kratos to die, and then Loki can do his thing. But that's not what they did. So now I'm like, I don't know what the <laughs> are they going against their word and making a, another one or absolutely um, they made fifty trillion dollars off this. Their studios are like, come on, baby, yeah, Ray. Oh, his fist. Yes, yeah, right. He can beat the shit out of you. He can use that's your shield that. too, but. Yeah. That's so really, I mean, six weapons. If you attach the fucking weapon to your relic and you count the shield as a as a weapon, you, you just go the fuck off. Um, Dakota, do you think you'll be finishing the Ragnarok? I know you've been working on it here and there. At some point. I like watching you stream it here and there. Like whenever you don't have a game to play, you hop on that thing. I like watching it because I love that game. Yeah. Um, Jeff. For them to make a third, what would it have to be? Like, where, where the, what, what are they going to do? I, uh, I don't know, because of the way they, the way it ends with Atreus, it, they, they, they can't jump to another mythology yet, unless they completely disregard the way it ended. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It would make sense if for, I guess they could just follow Kratos, not Loki can come in later. I don't know. But There's no way they're going to leave Loki out of this. How? No, they're not going to leave him out, but they have to skip the entire ending they set up for him, pretty much, if they stay with the Norse mythology. Or Joe they Kratos, skip how they would have to end it? I don't know, dude. What do you think, 
Dakota, where are they gone? I can't tell you because I don't know the end of the game, so. Oh, that's right. That's right. All right. Well, we'll leave that for another day then. Let's get into the main segment. Segment? This uh, today. All right. So look, we've been at we, uh, the first podcast back in a while. There's some new games coming out in the next couple months. I have a list here um, to talk about. And then I want to just check out Street Fighter 6 with you guys. <clears throat> at the end because there's some wild stuff going on i don't really get what's going on or if jeff i know you're a big fan of it if you've looked into it a lot um that's I don't the know. original announcement i got the gist of it but uh okay so we talked about forespoken that'll be out on the 20 uh fourth, fourth. dead space remake jeff you'll be streaming this one mm-hmm. coming out on the 27th uh it, it, uh Oh, and then Hogwarts Harry Potter experience. What what day? What's the date on that one? February twelfth, I believe, it was the twelfth. Oh, Two weeks after. Okay. I, I are you are you going to be streaming the hell? Are you going to be streaming the hell out of that one, Dakota? I'll stream it. I am too, but I think it's alright if we both do it, right? Oh well, I mean, there, it's 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 uh yeah, it's it's open. There's no way we're going to be able to go, be going the same path. Because I would like to do it on my, like, off days as well. Yeah, Why yeah. When I'm not doing Overwatch. Do it together. Oh, the, the ways make you feel that good. make us feel good. I take the low, you take the high, Jeff. <laughs> Let's do that. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Uh, Harry Potter. All right. Then Resident Evil 4. This is also a Jeff's oh, planned so stream. Oh, God. When's that? Yeah. What's, the date on, what's the date on that? March. Is that that soon? God, I feel like that was still like far away. I want to say it's near my birthday, and my birthday is March 13th. Speaking of my birthday, are we going to cheat on Chili's this year and go to Applebee's? <sighs> yeah, either way, it sounds awful. <laughs> it's both it's sad. Just, well, that, that Chili's. You know what I'm hoping, though, is we go to. It's terrible. <laughs> I'm hoping we go. Let's go to Chili's again, and it's and it gets worse. I would want to see that. <laughs> just every year, it's just worse. There's, worse. it's like when we took uh, the name we shall not say to Woodshed Two, and there was the fucking that worked out perfectly. <laughs> hookers throwing up. <laughs> that worked out perfectly. Like, actually, is this real life? <laughs> uh, Resident Evil Four remake, March twenty fourth. 24th okay so it's after it's a it's a couple weeks after my birthday yeah because right. you're, you're going if you're going out what games are coming out you're going a little out of order but oh, that's fine uh, is there an order that you see them that you want to uh, yeah there's a ton of there's an order of games that are coming am out. i missing I mean, some atomic heart what 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 day february 21st okay that's gonna be oh that's t- straight to um game, game pass. pass right yep and then the next bigger one would be uh, Wolong Long Fallen Di- uh, Dynasty. When's that? that? That's March 3rd. I wonder if this list that I have is just for PlayStation. It could be. Is, and then, uh, I don't is, know if, you've, if Stolen Bones is on your thing, that's March 9th. Oh, no, oh, I don't have it on here. Stolen maybe I maybe I just grab. I mean, this must be a PlayStation. But no, but there's Legend of Zelda. I don't know what this is. And then uh, next one would be Star Wars Jedi Survivor. That is March hey! 17th. That's going to be really good. I can't fucking wait. Champ! Uh, okay, so Star Wars Jedi Survivor. Then what What do you got? Next big one after that is going to be Resident Evil 4. The 24th okay. of March. And then after that would be... <clears throat> no, I'm kind of excited. It's going to be fun. Uh, Dead Island 2. Yes. Ooh, yeah, that'll be good. Yes. That's I April 28th. We'll all be getting our hands on that one. Probably, I'd probably be multiplayer. Um, yeah. And then Legend of Zelda uh, Tears of the Kingdom as May 12th. And then Perfect. what about Final Fantasy? I got Final Fantasy 16 so on my list. That's not that's not yet. This next would be Suicide Squad, Kill the Justice League, May 26th. Hey, about that game? That's Kevin Conroy's last Batman voiceover. Yep. Yeah. Sad so day. Gotta get it. Uh, Street Fighter 6 on June 2nd. Diablo right. 4, June that's, 6th. Yep. But that's far enough. We can, we can stop well, there. We can, we'll finish the last one with Final okay. Fantasy 16. Oh, yeah, yeah. June 22nd. And actually, I'm sorry, I got one more for me. Uh, Baldur's Gate 3, full release. Nothing else coming out besides small pa- small patch, but... Full release. Yeah, full release, which is well, kind of um, huge. What about... When's Starfield supposed to come out? Never. They don't have a date on that yet. 
I thought, yeah. oh my god, it ain't coming out this year. It says twenty twenty three, it probably, but it ain't coming no, out this no year. Game. There's no. Game. There's a ton of like to be announced games that are all look good, but they're probably not coming out this year. No. All right, let's let's pull you pull up the Street Fighter Six things just so we can all take a look, and then I just have some questions about like what the fuck's going on. Uh, do you want closed beta impressions? What what exactly are we looking for here? I'm not sure. Nothing that's like want, long as fuck. I just you want just gameplay. Yeah, or like overview. That's of, what I have overview, and the most one is by IGN, which is gonna be closed beta impressions. All right, cool. Mm-hmm. Yeah, let me see that thing. Let me see that thing. All right, let me uh hold on. Let me get out of here. Let me go ahead and share my screen. I got out of this one. Yes, yes. I go live <coughs> now, Jeffrey. Pull up. You click the button. Uh, watch stream. We are watching you. Yep. Let me know when you guys ready. <coughs> ready. Here comes a new challenger. I'll cut to the chase. Street Fighter 6 <coughs> beta was the best fighting game beta I've ever played. And I'm not even talking about the quality of the game, even though that too is really, really good. I'm talking about everything from the presentation to the stellar netcode to the gorgeous battle hub to the ease of finding matches. All right, yeah, like some of this shit. Number of options and modes accessible. Most important among those being a training mode, which really should be standard at this point in fighting game betas. Street Fighter 6's closed beta checked all the boxes, then added new boxes and checked those too. Talk about the open world thing, story mode. 30 seconds in the video. Over the last few months, and the strong first impression now. I left has more than held up now that I played many hours of the beta. Street Fighter 6 feels fantastic. It's hard hitting, fast paced, and powered by the excellent drive system that opens up a whole world of new tools and options for every character. One of my big takeaways from my time with the beta was how much I love the drive rush mechanic. Basically, at the cost of one bar of the drive meter, you're able to execute a quick green glowing death and perform any move out of it. This was a vital technique when it came to facing off against Dope. battle players especially, who were keen to spend the whole match a full screen away, pelting me with sonic booms all day. Drive Rush offered me a surprisingly quick way to close the distance, land either a throw or a sneaky low attack to catch him off guard, and put myself in a more advantageous position. And that's just one use of the technique. For three bars of your drive meter, you can use a drive rush to cancel out of certain attacks and continue a combo. For example, if I were to hit yeah, it's just a focus cancel from five. That yeah. Combo into anything, I could use a drive rush cancel to dash in and convert a combo off of something that I normally would have just gotten a yeah, that's hit off. Sick, though. The whole system lends a ton of flexibility to Street Fighter 6's combo system, and I can't wait to experiment more with it once I get my hands on the full game. Then there's the drive impact. This maneuver will be the make it or break it point for many people when it comes to how much they enjoy Street Fighter 6's fighting system in comparison to other entries. Drive Impact is an extremely powerful strike that can muscle through up to three normal hits in order to deal a devastating blow of its own that will crumple an enemy and leave them open for a full combo. It's like an ultimate in Soul Calibur or something. Against the floor in the corner, and even if it's fun, it will still it's a big break. Yeah. Well mm-hmm. and give you a combo opportunity. It's a move that you will love when it works in your favor and absolutely despise when it's used against you. I myself mm-hmm. have gone back and forth on how I felt about Drive Impact all throughout the beta, and ultimately I ended up in a place where I appreciated what it brings to the table. It's an extraordinarily powerful technique to be sure, but there is still counterplay to it. Talk about the thing! Just long enough to be reactable. I know how to I know how to play Street Fighter. No, you don't, because these are new. <laughs> Upper ego, high you can attack it, suppress it. Can also be jumped over and punished, parried and punished, or if you can jab it three times quick enough, you can break its armor and punish. There's also an inherent mind game at play when you get put in the corner, because it is so strong. People are more likely to try to use it and get that wall splat, so you can be even more ready to try and react to it. Of course, if you're too focused on trying to react to the drive impact, you're vulnerable to basically everything else. Basically, being in the corner is very dangerous in every fighting game, but Drive Impact makes it especially <coughs> harmful. There were eight characters available to play. Yeah, yeah, oh, you can, John. Lee, sure you can. Jamie, Luke, so that, is that like his ultimate right there? That was one of them. And Fuck, that's dope. Of time with all of them, the two characters that I gravitated towards. And you guys are brothers. Stop fighting. Ken is wildly different from his Street Fighter Five incarnation, complete with two brand new moves 
a new command run that alters the properties of several of his special moves and seemingly can call has off that damn that's sick reckless, as many can cans your boy it's our boys I need to go to play Ken. <laughs> yeah oh yeah I yeah. didn't know that. Sorry, sorry. I called you Ken. <laughs> sorry, Ken. Makes up for it by the fact that they look sick as hell and deal a ton of damage. Oh, you're fucked. Oh my god! What the? I now have a fetish. Oh my god! It's Jerry. Talk about the thing. She builds charges to enhance them. Her They're not going to talk about story mode. Another one charged, and she's able to directly cancel. I don't know yet. Move when she's got charges loaded. I know it. Crow also has absurdly good range, and while I didn't get to mess around with it too much. Oh my god, she's dope. Level two super seems to give her. She's been in since four. I think. She's oh, she's not new. No. Getting a look at Street Fighter Six's ambitious battle. No. An online hub where players create this. their own avatar and wander around a virtual arcade. Pull up on an arcade cabinet, challenge another player, or just play in the cabinet cool. your own and wait for someone to challenge. Is this it? What I'm talking about? Alone is not a new idea. Arc not the entire thing. Been doing avatar-driven online lobbies for years, but it's never been done on a scale quite like this. For one, the avatar creator. God. Jeez. <laughs> oh, no. oh my oh, God. Oh, Dang, that's, that is literally <laughs> Jeff's body frame. <laughs> Special moves from the game. There's a photo booth, a shop for you to purchase new gear using currency earned while playing, a section where you can play classic Capcom games like Final Fight, and another section where you can play the special extreme mode. Best of all, if you don't want to engage with any of the arcade cabinets and you just want to automatically get pulled into a match, you can turn on ranked or casual matchmaking. Based on the beta, I feel extremely confident that Street Fighter 6's full launch will truly be a monumental moment for the fighting game community. But not only that, this beta sets the standard for future fighting game betas to follow by including literally everything a fighting game fan could reasonably want from an early look at a highly anticipated game. A decent selection of characters. I think this one was mostly for code, specifically the beta, and they probably didn't, yeah, have, that, they didn't have that story stuff in the I, beta. I didn't. I, I, man, I swear, I saw like. Jeff, am I crazy or Dakota? Have you seen what, I, what I'm talking no, about? Like, oh, yeah, see, there's the open world trailer. That's what we saw before. This is the open way? Yeah, but they don't go in depth like they just did there, that. Game, is there a no. gameplay of it though? I, Maybe. Let's just look at this. Let's see. Capcom. Thought it was actually a game <laughs> or this trailer. <laughs> this is. When you go looking for strength, it's not like a game. This journey doesn't have a real ending. Okay, then. Who's this dude? <clears throat> He's new. He's new. Luke. Uh... That Matt Mercer's voice? Don't know. Sound like him. Probably. All right, so there. This is Street Fighter Six. Yeah. Yep. Oh hell yeah! I don't get it, but I like it. Look at him, he's doing stuff! Yeah, see? Oh. It's like Shenmu! Probably. And then you fight like Chung Li and shit. Yeah. yeah. I don't want to fight her. Oh, I do. To lose to her so bad. I want to lose to her so bad. I want to lose to her really quick. <laughs> so fast. So fast that I win. Yeah, I'm just gonna fall when she like tries to hit. Yes. Oh. Are you fighting Minecraft characters? Yeah. Hey, it's the dude from Tekken. These two guys are new. Yeah, Jamie and Luke. He's a Hadouken, John. You see that? Oh, the fast leg kick! 
Oh, dude, that's fucking. I just brought Lee from fucking Tekken. Yeah. Oh, that was sick. Oh, God. Yes. Mikey, that's absolutely right. Oh, uh, holy shit. Yeah, that's the one I was looking for. I didn't know it was like just a straight trailer. I thought it was something I stumbled upon a while back. No, was, uh, that was like the first one they showed for it. Oh, my God, dude. That looks sick. You guys excited for it? Yeah, I mean, it'll be fun. Yeah, for yeah, sure. I want to see more details on they. Jeff, we can get Fight Night going again. Duken. Duken. What else did you got to see about it? How do you do, Ken? Just that, that was like the very first thing they dropped for it. I'm sure there's other stuff I just haven't seen yet. Oh, yeah. Got to look more into it. Yeah. All right, boys. That's it for today. It was good to be back, you guys. Thanks for hanging out. Ooh. Um, Ooh, yeah, uh, next Tuesday. I'll see you again. And then, um, will it, can I drink next Tuesday? Is it still? It's still January. Yeah. Damn it. That's all right. This is cool. Uh, Time goes by so fast when you're sober. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> anyway, cheers. Thanks for hanging out, you guys. Have a great night, yeah. and we'll see you soon. GGS out of here. Hey. Peace out.